Today I'm going to show you how you can get 5 stars in Theme Park Tycoon 2. But before we do hop into it, please do subscribe as we're so close to 2,000 nice. subscribers. It would really be amazing if you did. So let's hop into the first thing that you need to do. Of course this is going to be in your park that you do want 5 stars in. So I'm going to guess that you have quite a lot of money uh, because you're probably stuck on how to get 5 stars or something. So I've just given myself some money, 132,000. Now the first thing that you do want to do if you do run out of money is to build a money farm and I've already made a separate tutorial for that so click up there somewhere top right if 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 you do want to watch that video and it, as it shows you how to make a money farm easy so I've just loaded up this park right here and as you can see there is a money farmer right down here so basically to get your first couple of stars you're obviously going to need well if you already have a money farm you're going to be pretty much set as my money farm has given me one and a half stars but I'm not at those two stars so how you get two stars is you're going to want a lot of benches I'm just going to go down here and yep I do not have any benches that's why I do not have two stars. I don't have any places for my guests to sit, relax, and gain up their stamina. Do they even have stamina in this game? Uh, no, they don't have stamina, but they do have happiness. And as you can see, most of them aren't really happy. But we'll get onto that later. So to get those first couple of stars, you're going to need to head down to paths and go to seats because people are going to need to sit down. And any of these benches or tables should do. I'm just going to place some down here. And I'll be back to you guys in a second. Also, it may... Oh, jeez. Jeez, never mind. I was going to say that it may take a while. I've just got up one and a half stars to now <laughs> three and a half. So yeah, you're going to want some benches for people to sit. And because people need to go toilet, you are going to need at least one or more of these restroom stalls. And how you get those is actually go down to stalls and go down to other stalls. And there you go. There's your restroom and just place that wherever you want. So you should have around two stars now with some benches and stalls. And to get three stars, you're going to need to have some roller coasters. So if you have a money farm, you should already have three stars around now. Uh, so basically what you want to do is just done what I've done right here and what I've done is basically grabbed like a really cheap coaster which is either the wild mouse or the junior I've basically just gone out by three as you can see and then I've just gone up by three and then that's your that's your roller coaster done basically just do that multiple times once again if you haven't already watched my video where I build a money farm that can give you way more information than I just gave you there and then you want to just open that to the public and you should have around three stars all right now that you've added benches stools and roller coasters it's time to get your four stars to get four stars you're going to want to have bins literally everywhere but that's not it there must be no trash in your park at all so this might take quite a long time but if you have trash everywhere and you're like oh my i can't be bothered to get rid of that just delete the path and replace it it'll be a lot quicker than to clean it all up <laughs> but there should be no trash anywhere in your park and if you're like why am i not at four stars yet i have like no trash you need lights now as you can see i have three and a half stars but i have like bins everywhere with no trash and you're like how come you don't have it then because i have no lights so you want to go to paths you want to go to lanterns and you want to go to lights any of these lights should do i'm just going to use these ones because they are pretty cheap they're one of the cheapest so i'm just going to place these everywhere and i should see that i get four stars real soon and you want to place these basically everywhere in your park <gasps> i was wondering why i wasn't getting the four stars <sighs> I've got trash in my park, get rid of that. I should now get four stars. Or why am I not getting four stars? Do I have trash somewhere? All right, I've added a ton of lights now and I do not know why I'm not at four stars. I should be at four stars, unless if I haven't found any trash anywhere. Am I missing something? I think I've probably missed some trash somewhere. So once you hit four stars, or if you can't f actually understand why it's not giving you four stars and you're like three or three and a half, the next thing you want to do for five stars is to add scenery you're going to want to add loads of stools way more than you see here basically stools left right and center you want tons of stools and you want loads of benches like basically ev everything that we've done it just now but a ton more there still should be no trash in the park there's going to need to be a lot of benches and your guests are going to need to be very happy most of your guests need to be very happy to get five stars now this is not going to be really quick this does take some 
some time to get, but I recommend just going through scenery down here by pressing 3 and basically just placing it everywhere, even if it doesn't look that nice because you can always get rid of all of the stuff that you've done because once you hit 5 stars at some point, you, 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 you keep that, you keep that forever, even if the park goes away. So basically you just want to spam your area <laughs> with scenery. It won't look the nicest, but it will still get you 5 stars. I'm not really sure on the amount you're going to need. I just know you need to, to place a ton. I don't know why mine's not changing. It should. It should. I, unless if I miss some trash, I probably miss some trash if I'm being honest. But make sure you've got tons of stools and tons of restrooms, tons of food stools, tons of roller coasters. Oh, there we go. I got four stars just by adding some scenery. And yeah, it does slowly trickle up the more that you add. Uh, as you can see, it doesn't look the nicest, but hey, it should work once you do all of the steps times a lot. So yeah, you should be around three to five stars, maybe three and a half to five stars, uh, depending on, I don't even, I don't really know why I'm not hitting five stars. I'm just going to add stools everywhere because as you can see, there's only stools around in the middle and the end. So I'm just going to try and add restrooms everywhere as well as food and drinks because your guests need to be happy. And if they have to walk like ages to like get what they want, uh, they're not going to be very happy, are they? So basically you want all your guests to be happy. So if you see this park guest overview up here, basically just look i'm hungry try and add a few more stools basically just do what they are tr saying i need to dispose some trash you need more gas cans more trash cans sorry <laughs> i need to sit down that you, you need to place more benches you basically need to just go off of what your guests are saying and you should hit five stars let's do a quick summary of all of this so you know what to do so you're going to want to add a load of benches a load of stools and a load of restrooms stools being drink stools and food stools and maybe the hat stools uh tons of roller coasters if you have a money farm you don't really need to worry about that you're going to want to have lights basically everywhere. Uh, scenery, I'm not really sure if you need to spam the scenery or not. Just have quite a few scenery there. And if you feel like you don't have enough, just add more until you get the achievement. Listen to your, what, your, uh, your, what your park guests are saying by clicking the thing at the top right. And basically just do what they're saying. If they're hungry, add more food stalls. If they're thirsty, add more drink stalls. And there must be no trash in your park at all. I don't know if you've got any of that, but basically listen to your guests. Add a whole bunch of stuff, scenery, stalls, roller coasters, no trash anywhere. Basically just make your park look really nice and have a whole bunch of scenery, decorations. Sleep guests must be really, really happy. Like most of your guests have to be on full happiness basically all the time until you hit five stars and once you do it should pop up in the chat saying that you've gotten the what's it called the incredible theme park achievement i know i didn't hit five stars guys i just want to say that i do know i didn't hit five stars i hit four stars but the reason being that i didn't hit five stars is that it doesn't just happen like this it does take quite a while but I thank you all very much for watching. I appreciate you. And I'll see you whenever. Bye.